Here with Reaction, South Carolina Senator Lindsey Graham is with us. So you got 10 million or so unvetted Joe Biden illegal immigrants. Yeah. Uh, we're paying for food, water, housing, education, health care. Yeah. Cities are overwhelmed. Even Democratic mayors and governors have had it. Uh, and yet they've been telling yeah. us the whole time that the border is secure and closed. <laughs> it's not. Yeah. Um, and look at the impact. I mean... What is the end game here? Why do they have no interest? Do they not? Do they, do they not get alarm bells in their mind when you hear people from Iran and Syria and Egypt and Afghanistan and Russia and China are there? Because that's where they're coming well, from. Yeah, well, fentanyl poisoning of our young people is the leading cause of death among Americans from 18 to 35. It's coming across the Mexican border. It's made in China, comes to Mexico, comes across the border. The drug cartels, human traffickers have been the biggest beneficiary uh, of the Biden presidency. Why is President Trump leading in South Carolina by 30 points? The people of South Carolina believe that Donald Trump was the best Republican president since Ronald Reagan. People in South Carolina do not believe that Trump creates chaos. They believe that Donald Trump can clean up the chaos being created by Biden, that Donald Trump is our best hope to secure the border, to make us energy independent, to manage the economy, and to put out all the fires in the world. Nikki Haley is a good person. Tim Scott is one of my best friends. I endorsed Donald Trump on day one because I saw from a front row position of four years of the toughest guy I've ever seen in Washington who brought the world to a better place on national security than anybody since Reagan, who made us strong at home uh, and strong overseas. Donald Trump's going to win South Carolina big, not because we don't like Nikki Haley. We do. We just believe Donald Trump is the best person to be president. And without Donald Trump, there are no Trump policies. Can you explain this to me? We're going to have an open primary if Donald Trump wins the general election or not. He's won decisively in both New Hampshire and Iowa. That's not happened since 1976. She's not yeah. competing in Nevada. Uh, so now we have uh, South Carolina next, and she's down, real clear politics average, down 30 points. Why would she risk losing in her home state by such a big margin when she could come back in, in three, four years yeah. and, and run a campaign in an open primary where I think anybody's odds would be better? Don't you think? Well, uh, Nikki Haley has been her friend for a very long time. She was a two-term governor, and people like her. Her numbers are good at home. Why is she losing to President Trump? It's no fault of her. It's the assets and attributes of President Trump. I can't express enough to the people watching your show that those of us in South Carolina who respect Nikki Haley believe that Donald Trump is the most capable person to be president that can beat Joe Biden, but not just beat Joe Biden, clean up a broken border, scare the hell out of the terrorists, help Israel who's under siege, make us energy independent again. Why do I say that? Because he did it before. Nobody running on the Republican side can say they've been president except him, Donald Trump. And when you compare his presidency to that of Joe Biden, he's going to beat Joe Biden uh, like a drum. That's why he's going to win South Carolina. That's why he's going to be the next president of the United States. He's the best person to do the job and to clean up the mess created by Joe Biden. And by the way, the way that Tim Scott's been treated by liberals in the media, the yeah, way all, many African-Americans are treated yeah. that are conservative uh, in the media, it's it's repulsive. Uh, anyway, yeah, good to ha have you back. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.